Hi, I'm Ed Ellis, and this is Michael Martin Murphy, and we're here in one of the Rio Grande Scenic Railroad dome cars. Um, this is our fourth year of doing concerts up at the top of La Vida Pass. Yep. I remember the first one. Time, time passes swiftly when the railroad runs on time, Ed. <laughs> <laughs> you came up, it was, uh, it was uh, like, I think it was September of, it would have been 2007. Right. And this has turned out to be my dream gig. The first time I played it, uh, I just did one show for you, and that was kind of late in the season. Yeah. And uh, I loved it so much, I just hounded you to death <laughs> about well, wanting, wanting to do this as a regular thing. And uh, it's turned out to be the best venue I've ever played. It's, it's my dream to be able to play at 10,000 feet in the Rockies with a 360 view of the mountains and great sound and then walk up and down the train and meet people and, and even have jam sessions on the cars. It's been great for us, too, and the venue has gotten better each year. The first year, we just had a piece of plywood for you to sit <laughs> That's on. That's right. And some canvas, maybe. That's it. A that covered it. stage. Right? <laughs> and then uh, by the second year, uh, we had gotten to a little stage. It was actually built by the guy behind the camera. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, we, we had a sound system. And then last year, which was really cool, we actually built a stage. We built, it's got a green room, it's got a little equipment room. We've got a place up at the top of the hill where you get off the train with a little station and uh, we went green. Yeah, we, uh, we ran into some people from out in Oklahoma that uh, I actually did some spokesperson work for because I'm really into, uh, into uh, having a more energy efficient world. And, uh, you know, you said, man, you know, the only thing I really hate is the generators right, that we have exactly. to run in the background up here because we're off the grid and we, we can't get power up here. And so I said, aha, <laughs> a light bulb went on over my head. We called them up and uh, they put in a wonderful uh, wind turbine and a great solar array. And uh, we're 100 percent off the grid up there, you know, powering up and putting out great sound and doing it all from the, from the sun and the wind. Well, you've, you've introduced us to some some great artists, too. We've had uh, we've had Ricky Skaggs. We've had a sleep at the wheel. We've had a bunch of uh cool guys and then we had um, we've also introduced kind of some new people uh, last year we had Larry Penn who's a great uh, railroad troubadour and he'll be back this year as an opening well, I, I gotta just stop for a second and say Larry Penn was a brilliant addition to this thing because the guy is the real thing he is you know it's like in the cowboy world if you could book Gene Autry you know <laughs> to be on your concerts Larry right. Penn is the man when it comes to writing railroad songs yeah and we had some great jam sessions with him also. We and, did. Uh, people loved it, his stories, too. And this is really all about uh, storytelling and uh, the culture of the West and, and the people that love railroads. So, Larry, we'll be back. You'll be back. And we've got a bunch of new acts. And if you go to our website at coloradotrain.com, uh, the whole Roots and Boots Summer Music Festival is there. You can read about everything that's going on. Look forward to seeing you there. Look forward to seeing you there. Okay. Thank you. Highball it, Ed. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs>